Hey, hello, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel and um, also welcome to my new uh, light setup. Um, if you've seen previous videos of me, <coughs> sorry, you might uh, notice that uh, well, uh, the, the light quality is uh, better today. I hope you like it and uh, today I'll be unboxing uh, this uh, Bixler version 3 from Hobby King. You probably know uh, the model. So, um, this is a plug and fly, uh, the, the ready to fly uh, version, so everything should be included, uh, I think, apart from the batteries uh, for the transmitter. So, let's dig in. Okay, um, welcome back to uh, <laughs> normal speed. Uh, let's see what we have received. Um, I'll uh, begin with the uh, big parts. Uh, uh, you will uh, receive uh, a fuselage and it's uh, already uh, glued together the two uh, fuselage halves. No assembly required on that. Servo for the tail here and here. Both servos are already installed. Motor is already installed. And I assume the ESC is already installed as well. Hi, uh, there's the ESC. A no, Hobby King, no, uh, no brand, uh, 20 amp ESC. Uh, with a XT60 connector on it already and here you have a 2.4 MHz receiver it's a 7-channel um, receiver okay next big thing is uh, the wings of course um, I'll leave it in its uh, wrapping, uh, but as you can see the aileron servo is already installed. Uh, the link uh, for the aileron is already installed as well. The flap servo has not been installed as that doesn't come as standard with the kit. Uh, with, with this version, with any version I think. Uh, but with my order, I also ordered some uh, digital, uh, no analog uh, Metal Gear servos, the TGI 9018MG. Doesn't come standard. All right, that's your wing and well, decals uh, already applied. And this is really nice, the ailerons have hinges, I hope you can see that. These are hinges and the flaps don't have the hinges on them yet. Maybe they are supplied somewhere in the 
parts bin, but... Okay, well, there you go, one wing, and you won't be surprised to see that there is another wing, and it looks more or less the same, of course. Up we go, and next thing is your horizontal stabilizer. And, well, it's a horizontal stabilizer, nothing special uh, with that, of course. Next thing is your vertical stabilizer, the control lever uh, rod, no, the, uh, the control tab is already uh, glued in. Nothing special for the rest. Okay, and here is a parts bag, and yes. Here I see the hinges for the flaps. That's very nice. I'm glad they uh, supplied uh, those. There's some Velcro in here. There's some glue that nobody uses. There are wheel pads, a propeller with prop adapters, uh, two Y leads for your ailerons and your flaps. And okay, that's about it. I think yeah, some small, some small uh, parts. Okay, and next thing is a landing assembly, wheels and frame, and they look they look sturdier than I had expected. I think they they will uh, be useful. Of course, if you are uh, taking off and landing on uh, rough uh, grass or uh, like that uh, or something, uh, you well, I, I would advise you to just uh, belly land uh, the plane. But doesn't uh, look completely useless. Very nice. All right, uh, this is a USB adapter for your transmitter and a CD or DVD. I'm not sure what's on it. Uh, maybe software to set up the transmitter and a bind plug. Okay, and with the kit, this does come with the kit, is a, a 3 cell 2.2 uh, Turnigy LiPo with the XT60 connector. Very nice. And the last thing that's in uh, the box is a Balance charger uh, with alligator clips. Of course, this is nothing uh, uh, luxurious, but uh, it'll get you started. So, um, let's not forget uh, this thing. This is, uh, of course, a transmitter. Uh, nothing luxurious here either, uh, but it'll uh, get you started. That's nice. And as you can see, this one is a Mode 1 transmitter. Uh, I Personally, fly uh, mode 2, so uh, throttle on this stick. So, I'll have to uh, convert this uh, transmitter. Now, if you would like me to do a video on how to uh, convert a transmitter like this, uh, please let me know in the comment section below, and I'll do a video on that uh, as well. And uh, this is a alternate uh, canopy piece. This is the Standard canopy, and this is a camera slash FPV canopy, and it's I think it's uh, very uh, nice that they uh, included uh, standard uh, in the box. Okay, um, well in the future I'll uh, do uh, some flight video with this plane, and uh, probably also um, after some flights uh, uh, video about uh, what kind of part of the plane. So. Okay, thanks for watching again, um, hope you're already uh, subscribed, otherwise uh, please do, thanks in advance, and see you in the next video, bye bye.